Hello, Caroline. How are you? I'm doing great. How are you doing? I am doing extremely well, thank you. So I am from home in Corsica. Where are you? I am in Miami right now. It's uh, beautiful weather. It's uh, sunny out. It's actually a little cooler than normal, but it's uh, it's nice. Okay, but it's sunny, so it's a, it, it is, this is the sunshine state. So let me put on my sunglasses. <laughs> Absolutely. Have a full Miami look. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so hello, guys, hello, everybody. So thank you for joining us for this very special live with Caroline from Miami. So Caroline, can you tell us who are you? Yes, I'm Caroline Wozniacki. I'm a former professional world number one in tennis and Grand Slam champion. And now I just love working out, looking radiant, and uh, I'm part of the Clemence family. So, uh, so yeah, that's... Uh, <laughs> okay, good. So, okay, you are number one in tennis, but are you number one in makeup? You know... That's, I think you're number one in makeup and you're hot. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Okay, Caroline. So that's the reason why, okay, we are doing this live together because I would like to ask you first, as we are asking to all our guests and all uh, the women in the world, how can I help, how can I help you today? Yes. When it comes so... to your makeup, to your makeup routine, to your makeup desires, your needs, your concerns, tell us. Yes, so I think for me, I'm such a sporty woman. I love being out there running, playing tennis, you know, doing all sorts of activities, uh, yoga. So for me, it's so important that I want to look fresh. I want to look like my skin is, you know, glowing. I want to look pretty, but at the same time, I don't want when I start sweating that the makeup starts running, you know? So it needs to stay in place, not too thick, but at the same time, yeah, you know, I just want to feel pretty. And I think it's also <laughs> important that it doesn't take too long because for me, I'm always quick. It's I wake up in the morning, I just want to do something quick for my face to look good, and I'm off running or doing whatever. So that's kind of the main things for me. And also something that is good for my skin, something that, you know, makes it even more radiant with time, you know, and, and helps it feel feel good, look good, be shiny, prevent wrinkles, all these things. That <laughs> so looking for the best. Yes. So you are in very good hands. And you know, because we have, you know, uh, viewers from all over the world, you know, I can see that people are saying hello from India, from Indonesia, Surabaya, from London, uh, from France, from all over the world. And you know, Caroline, you are not the only one. Uh, many, many women, you know, they don't have an hour or half an hour or even 20 minutes in the morning just to look good and to apply their makeup. So uh, today, because first you are very sportive because you live in Miami. So you're doing a lot of, you know, uh, outdoor um, exercise. We're going to do something quite easy, simple, uh, but beautiful. And because, okay, you spend a lot of time, you know, uh, uh, out, uh, we are going to select uh, the best makeup products to protect your skin against the pollution, against UV rays and all external aggressions. Uh, that's the reason why, okay, did you know that uh, Clarins makeup is made for skin? I actually did know that. So that's the exciting Aha. part about Exciting parts about being part of the class. So Clara's makeup, yeah, Clara's makeup is made for skin. What does that mean? It means that all the makeup products are infused with plant extract. What for? Uh, to make sure that you're going to prolong the benefit of your skincare products first, and to make sure that your makeup is going to treat your skin and to take care of your skin. And more you are going to wear Clara's makeup, more your skin is going to look beautiful even without makeup. That's amazing. I mean, that's a dream for any woman, I think. Okay, that, that makes, you know, uh, Clarins makeup so different compared to uh, many other makeup products that they, okay, they just uh, look very good when you apply. It's just a question of color, 
But for, for me, it's so important to take care of your skin, to protect the skin, to moisturize your skin, to hydrate the skin for all day long. We are going to start with your complexion, Caroline, because okay. you don't have that much time. You want something simple. You've told me that, you know, uh, because uh, you are doing a lot of efforts or whatever, so your skin, you don't like when your skin is a little bit shiny, you, when your skin is a bit, when you are sweating. So you're looking for something quite matte, very lightweight texture, not yes. thick at all. So that's the reason why I did select for you. And I am sure you received it in Miami. Uh, my favorite SRS primer. So this is the SRS primer number two, Peach. Yes. A SRS primer, you know, Caroline and, 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 and guys, okay? It's not just a primer. A primer usually, okay, you use a primer before applying your foundation and your makeup. A primer is to prepare your skin to make the application of the makeup easier. Uh, and faster, and it's going to fix your makeup. But for us, for Clarins, the SMS primer, we do expect more from this product. We want this product to take care of your skin. So first, to moisturize your skin for uh, all day long. And that's the reason why the SMS primer is infused with uh, organic CLD extract. It's a beautiful white flower that grows, you know, on the beach. And the power of that plan is really to hydrate your skin for at least 12 hours. So you're going to have an all day, perfect, moisturized skin. Uh, yeah. So it's going to hydrate your skin, it's going to prepare your makeup, it's going to uh, correct uh, skin imperfections that all women that they want to see in the mirror in the, in the morning or even in the afternoon or the evening. So it's going to correct all skin imperfections and it's going to give you extra radiance and luminosity because you don't want your skin to shine, but you're looking for radiance, luminosity. Absolutely. So let's apply a little bit one pump, you know, on your hands. You're going to warm up yes. the texture slightly, <laughs> yeah. And you're going to apply always, you know, with uh, the Clarins method, which is to start by the chin, cheeks, and forehead. And then you're going to smooth it out with large soft movement from the center to outwards with very soft movement. movement. We don't want to tie the skin because even the okay, Clarins uh, application techniques are made for skin. So are made to maintain the quality and the youthfulness of your skin. So you mm -hmm. can put all over the face, even the eye contour, and if you need a little bit more, you know, uh, uh, coverage, which is correct a little, more, a little bit more where it's needed. So sometimes on the cheeks, a little bit on the forehead or the chin, you can add a little bit more and you just dab where you need to correct a little bit more and it's going to blend instantly onto your skin. So there's a lot of people from everywhere. I oh, see that. Hello, hello. <laughs> so, how, what do you think about the application? What do you think about the texture and the application? It's so around? smooth, it's so easy to do. For me, you know, I just, I am not great at putting on makeup and, and I always find it so complicated, but this feels like I have nothing on, but it feels like it already made my skin more even. It's exactly. I look fresh, you know, yeah. that's exactly what I, what I like. It feels silky, you know, even on my, my hands where it was, it just feels silky and smooth. It's very it's nice. Really it's really smooth and it's not sticky and oily. So that's the reason why all. it's never going to make your skin shiny. Okay. So, and how does it, how do you feel your skin? Do you feel your I skin? Mean, it feels like my skin can breathe. It feels very, very just easy. It feels like I have nothing on right now, which is amazing. Exactly. Is That's why so, foundation a lot of times for me, I don't like because it feels, you know, it's thicker, it's heavier. And this, I feel like I'm just out there and I, this is how I wake up it, and look. It feels just like a second skin. You can feel like your skin is breathing. And you know that product, so the SOS primer, Number two, peach. The shade number two, peach, is ideal for all skin tones. Uh, and of course, you can use it alone. 
you don't need to apply a foundation. You can use it by its own uh, when you're looking for something very natural, quick and easy, a blend on texture, lightweight texture, something which is going to even brighten your complexion and correct skin imperfection and moisturize your skin. So this is a treatment at the same time. Good. So now we need to set to set, you know, the SRS primer even more because you are a very sporty woman and you live in Miami. And for the people, uh, if you are looking at us uh, from India or Indonesia or hot and humid climates, uh, this is ideal, you know, if you want to really fix, you know, your, your makeup. So I'm going to ask you to use the pore mattifying kit. I love this kit. I love this kit because you can see that you have a translucent powder, so it looks white, but it's totally transparent. All skin tones, they can use uh, the pore mattifying kit. And just you have the applicator, the sponge applicator, and under the sponge applicator, you have absorbing papers. They're made with bamboo extract. And those absorbing papers, they're just going to absorb the excess of sebum that you have on your skin surface that are going to absorb any water, any moisture from your skin. So first during the day, okay, when you want to touch up and absorb uh, and get rid of any excess of sebum, you can use the absorbing paper. And to set your makeup, you can use your powder brush. Yep. This one, you take the powder, and you're going to apply the powder from the T-zone, so chin, the nose, the forehead, the tail of the nose where the skin is, shines a little bit more. Okay, so you just set the powder first, and then you're just going to sweep out. Okay. And as you can see, Caroline, and guys, you can see Caroline's face and skin, she doesn't look powdery at all. What do you think about the texture of that powder? I love it. It's so smooth. It's so soft and it's so great. I mean, it's, it's like soft. steel. It blends onto the skin instantly, immediately. You know why, Caroline? Because once again, uh, we add uh, some plants, plant extract into this powder. This powder is enriched with acacia micropores. And those acacia micropores are going to absorb excess of sebum or perspiration, just to mattify. It's going to uh, minimize the appearance of open pores and fine lines. So after applying, you know, that powder, your skin is going to look matte, smoother, and younger. I love it. You know, I don't, I don't want to go anywhere without this powder. And <laughs> I also don't, as you said, I don't like looking shiny. So for me, just having this little paper here, you know, and you can bring it anywhere and you just put a little bit, little dabs and you don't even have to worry about it. And made with bamboo. So once again, okay, we are protecting the nature and we're protecting your skin. So, and we're using the most, the best of nature. Wonderful. So, Next step, Caroline, is going to be the blusher. And I think that you have <clears throat> two blushers. I think that you have one, uh, the mocha. The number six mocha. Can you show us? Great. Okay, so when you open it, okay, don't be scared because it looks quite dark brown. Okay, but I love to use, you know, that blush as a bronzer and a blusher. And you will okay. see it looks just beautiful when you apply it. So, you're going to take your blush brush, this one. You're going to take a little bit from your blusher. Okay, you take a little bit and you're going to apply it as if you were applying a bronzer. So down to the cheekbone first and then the temple, yeah. To give structure to the face and then the temples. Great. And then a little bit on the forehead, you know, close to the hair. Just to I'll give put, it a little more, right? Or no? Sorry. I'll apply a little bit more. Yeah. Okay. Apply a little bit more. Yes, do not hesitate. Okay. 
especially the sun powder, okay, down to the cheekbone. You can apply a bit more, okay? It's the objective of using the mocha is really to warm up the old complexion as if you were using a bronzer because it is a bronzer and a blusher at the same time. Great. Add a little bit more here. And the chin, do not forget the chin. And then you can use the big powder brush or the same brush and you can blend all over the face. Blend all, of the, all over the face and the neck. Okay, just warm up the old look. I think a little bit on the forehead here. Great. Not too much. Great. And do you, do you have the big powder brush? I do not. Do you, you know, oh, you don't have this one. Just... I have this one. Oh, ah, that... yeah. So you can use this one because it's a blending brush. Okay. Okay. And you can blend, you know, all over the face very easily with that brush. Lovely. Great. And now I think that you also received the, uh, the Jolie Blush Coral. <laughs> Do you have the coral shade? Yes. And this one, we're going to use it as a blusher. Okay. And how to apply your blusher in a very simple way, because so many women all over the world are always ask, asking, how can I apply my blush? There's a very simple technique, guys. Do not, okay, remember during the past, years and years ago, during the antiquity, okay, the Greek people and the Egyptians, when the women were wanted to look fresh, they were just, you know, pinching, okay, the cheekbones here. So, Caroline, can you give us your most beautiful smile from Miami? <laughs> and you're going to apply, okay, the coral shade just on the cheekbone. On the cheekbone first, okay, just a touch. And then we will blend to make it extremely natural and soft. And to make sure that the color is going to blend onto this beautiful sun kiss uh, effect that you achieved because of the Mocha Jolie Blush, number six. This is good. This is really good. It's fresh, natural. You mm -hmm. look healthy, just like, you know, a very sportive and healthy woman. Yeah. You know, I feel like, like I just worked out. You know how you get that blush when you work out? And exactly. And I just look like that without the sweat. You know, that's like... Exactly. You know, when I am in the street and I look at the women, I just want to, when I look at them, I just want to say, oh my God, they look so fresh. They look so healthy. This okay. is really the objective of, you know, the makeup, in my opinion. It's not to wear a mask and to transform you, to make you look totally different. It's to enhance the beautiful features that you have. Okay. So, and once again, the Jolie Blush is infused with plants, oils, is enriched with hazelnut oil, really to smooth and moisture your skin for the whole day. So that's the reason why even the blusher are so soft and, wow. and so uh, pleasant to wear and very long lasting. Okay, so it's okay now for uh, the complexion. Let's have a little bit of fun with the brows. I okay. know that is, this is a challenge for you. This is challenging <laughs> for me because I always Work. have big, bold brows, but sometimes I overdo it and... Uh, <laughs> so, the objective, we're not going to overdo the brows. You just need a little touch of color and just to fix uh, the shape of your brows. That's it. That's the reason why we're going to use the Brow Duo number two. Yep. Number two, and it's a two-in-one product. So, we're going to start first by the powdery texture. The powdery texture, texture that comes with a sponge applicator. So do not hesitate. When you're looking for something extremely natural and soft, do not hesitate to remove a little bit of the excess of product from the applicator to make mm -hmm. sure that you're going to apply a very small amount. It's better to add than to apply too much and to try to blend. Okay. And you just need to apply, okay, that color where it's needed, where you need a little bit of color to make, you know, the brows more even this is perfect my god thank you you're a pro caroline yeah this is good i, I and i think it's quite it's quite enough yeah let's do the other side yes well, very so good let me put the other side my glasses to make sure because it looks really good 
Can you come closer from the screen, please? Yeah, this is good. Great, perfect. You were just adding a little bit. Yes, same on the other side. Slightly, you know, upper and the outer part of the brow. Yes, good. Just with the tip of the brow dew. Excellent. Very good, slightly longer. Great, excellent. Bravo. Thank you. Bravo. So <laughs> isn't it easy to use, by the way? So easy, so easy to use. And less is always more when we start. And then we can always add more. And depending on what you love, some people love big brows, some people, just, like me, I just love just adding just a little bit on the outside. and. And then, exactly, and this is all you need at the moment. And for those who are looking for perfect brows, you can really design perfectly the brows. If you are very sophisticated, you can even you know, use a little bit of concealer just below the brow and up to the brow to make it perfectly you know, designed. Yeah. But you don't need that, okay? We're looking for something quick, easy, efficient for every day. Exactly. So, we, when I can use this, then I know that everyone can use it, so. <laughs> Yeah, excellent. I was thinking that it could be a little bit more difficult for you, but you did extremely well. Just to show you that those products are so easy to use. And now you are just going to use the second applicator, which is a tinted gel. And once again, because you don't need a lot, so you yeah. remove a little bit the excess of product to make sure that you are going to apply a minimum of quantity. Mm -hmm. And you're just going to brush up the brows and then to lift the brows just to fix, to give a hint of color, and just to fix the brows. It is excellent, guys, okay? If you have a little bit of white hairs, okay, it's going to color, okay, to cover the white hair, and you don't need to tint your brows, you can just use the brow duo. And once again, Caroline, you can play tennis, you can uh, go out when it's hot and humid, you can even go to the sauna. You can go and swim. Uh, you are in Miami. Uh, it's going to be super long lasting. Very mm -hmm. easy to remove with your uh, eye makeup remover, but super long lasting. It will never, uh, never move. It will never, um, uh, never disappear during the day. Even if you touch it when it dries, your brows, they stay perfect, okay, for all day. I love that. That's so important. You know, you just want it to stay. You don't want to worry about it. <laughs> it's awesome. Ciao. We have people from Italy. Hello. How are you? <laughs> oh, yes. We have people from you know, everywhere. Norway. We have all this product. Sorry. All this product is... Oh, yeah. Yes. For sure, this product, the Brow Duo, is available in Indonesia. For sure. So next step, Caroline, is going to be the eye makeup. And once again, I did select for you the Ombre Quatre Couleurs, okay, the new eyeshadow, four shades, the 01 Nude Fairy Tale. Great. Nude Fairy Tale 01. That's how it looks on the inside, guys. So it comes with you know, a cover, a cover, of course, with a sponge applicator. But tonight, okay, because you have the, uh, the, the eyeshadow brush, we're going to use the eyeshadow brush. But for okay. those who prefer to apply the eyeshadow with the, the eyeshadow applicator, sponge applicator, we have inside. And you know what? Because we're looking for something quick, easy, and effective, efficient, we're just going to use one shade. And the shade that you, I would like you to use is this one, the second one down, which is a matte color, because you have uh, an highlighter here. You mm -hmm. have satin finish shade here, uh, another satin finish darker shade, and a matte shade here. So I would like you to use the matte shade, this okay. one, number two. And I would like you to use, because the objective is just to warm up your eyes to enhance the blue color of your, of your eyes and to make your eyes bigger. So just apply this color all over the lashes, along the lashes line and all over the mobile lid till the crease. You just follow the natural shape of your mobile lid. 
So once again, take a small amount. You can add a, a, a little bit to make it more intense if you want. So first you just apply Caroline on the mobile lid. And after, at the end, we will blend upward and upward. Oh. First you apply to get the intensity and then we will blend. Okay, okay, let's do the second side. Okay, the same before blending. Let's do the second side. Okay, along the lashes, as close to the lashes as possible. And just follow the natural shape of your mobile lid, okay, till the crease, the crease of the eye, all the mobile lid here. Of course, you need to check, okay, the intensity to make sure that both eyes, they get the same intensity. So let me wear my glasses to see a bit more and to see if we have questions. Hello, Victor. <laughs> so well, I love people. Oh. Okay, they, 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 they like it. Yeah, it really brings out the blue in my eyes. Oh, that. That's so nice. This is good. Okay, so now, Caroline, that you, you did apply, okay, the color all over the mobile lid, you're going to use the same brush, but you're going to clean it. Remove okay. the excess of powder of color with a paper tissue on the top of your hand. And okay. now you're just going to blend upwards and outwards just to make the color disappear into your natural skin tone. And you can see how easy, okay, this texture is to blend, very easy to blend. Okay, you just blend it upwards and outwards. Great, it blends, do not worry, you know, the, the color, because of the quality of the texture, it's yeah. so easy to blend, you will never uh, look too, too made up or whatever. So no, now, if you want, you can make it more intense. You can add color if you want to make it more intense. Uh, you can blend more if you're looking for something softer. But I think it looks very good. Can you come closer for the screen, please? Yeah, it looks good. I like it. Thanks, Caroline. You like it? I love it, yes. It it's matte. Good. It's great. It really it brings out the blue color of your eyes. And I just would like to show to everyone that when you have, you know, a a color quartet like this, it doesn't mean that you have to wear every day the full shades. One day you can use, you know, a very soft and matte shade. Another day you can combine, okay, the highlighter with the darker shade. And another day you can use, okay, the, the highlighter all over the mobile lid. You can use the darker shade on the outer corner. You can use, okay, the medium shade just on the crease and use the lightest shade again, okay, as a highlighter uh, down to the brow and the inner corner of the eye, that's it. So you can play. There's so many, you know, uh, techniques that you can use when you have full shades. I love that there's so many options with this. Many and, options. You know, so, with, and last step. Looks so different. I did select for you one of my favorite mascara. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Even the eyeshadow, you know, this is not just an eyeshadow, this is an eye primer. This is a primer too. Yeah. So no need to use any eye primer. The eyeshadow is going to stay perfect during the old days, never going to crease, okay, during the day. Because it does contain some bamboo powders. I love bamboo that. powders that works like an eye primer and make sure that the eyeshadow is going to be fixed for the old day. So even if you are sweating, you are running outside, outdoor, okay, when you're doing, you know, when you're playing tennis, mm -hmm. your eye makeup is never going to crease or to fade. So I love it's that. very important. Thanks to the bamboo powder, we love nature and we use the best of nature. <laughs> Favorite mascara, last step, just to open up the eyes. And yes, this is the 4D waterproof mascara. Waterproof, yes. why? Because you live in Miami, for the people who are looking for a very long lasting mascara, a mascara that does not smudge during the day, um, does not move, if, even if it's raining, if it's, even if it's hot and humid, even when you are doing your sport, you go yes. to the sauna or to the gym, your mascara is going to stay perfect. And once again, this mascara is a lash primer. It does contain a blue lotus wax that is going to protect, okay, your lashes for a long lasting waterproof uh, and life proof effect. So very easy to remove. You remove it with the instant eye makeup remover, okay. Um, and it's very easy to remove. Oftentimes I find, you know, Sorry. water 
mascaras are so hard to get off. They make your eyelashes so dry and, and Exactly. Hard. So this one is totally the opposite because of the blue lotus wax and because of the lash boosting complex. It does contain a lash boosting complex that it's uh, made with three different plant waxes that is going to treat your lashes, is going to make your lashes uh, grow faster, longer, and thicker. And it's going to really protect your lashes, so they're always going to, 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 be, to stay soft, extremely soft and never stiff. You will see, after the application, when the mascara is dry, your lashes are still very soft and yeah. not dry and not stiff at all. So, use this 4D waterproof mascara. I love the brush because the brush is not too big, it's not too small. Yeah. This is the ideal brush. And once again, when you apply your mascara, you look slightly down and you're going to start from, from the roots and you're going to go up till the tip of the lashes. Doing that movement, you're going to separate, you're going to make them longer and more curled. There we go. I feel there's a lot of people watching me right now putting on my mascara. Yes, but... yes, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to look at the question. And you're right, okay, you can use the tip of the brush just to do the out lashes. There we go. The out lashes. Oh, good, you are using a cotton bud, which is good. I I'm always have... saying that cotton buds are the best girlfriend. Because if you are doing a little bit of mistake, Leave it dry, leave dry a little bit your mascara, and thanks to the cotton bud, you remove it very easily right away after. Okay, same on the second eye, from, from second eye, from the root of the lashes, and you go up till the tip of the lashes to make them longer, to really coat them easily, to separate them, and to curl them. Many women are applying the mascara this way, but that way, you stick the lashes together, Okay, it's clumping and it's not so nice. So when you start by the roots and you go up till the tip, you separate, you curl them and you make them longer and they are perfectly coated. Wow, wow, wow. Makes a it big... even looks like you did apply, you did apply, um, you did apply an eyeliner pencil. I know, it's nice. Beautiful. Oh, I have someone from Canada. So it worked, you know, uh, uh, in, in Ontario, 11 years, Clarence regime, my skin, that of much younger woman. Ah, so there's a woman that you say from Canada, she's saying that wearing Clarence makeup makes her skin look much younger now. Yeah. Very good. I love it. I mean, Excellent. what do you think? It's also, you know, and if people, I think it's important also to, to say if, there are some people that don't pref that prefer non-waterproof. The 4D is both in waterproof and non-waterproof. Exactly, we have both versions. Oh, you are very, very lucky to have both. Yes, uh -huh. we have a regular 4D mascara, four dimension, dimensional mascara, and the waterproof version. So if you're not looking for waterproof, you go for the regular one. So does it, when you look at you now, Caroline, does it correspond to what you, were, you are looking for? This is perfect. I mean, I think I look fresh. My eyes are popping. I feel like I look, they look more blue. My, my brows are in, in, you know, perfect place. And I have a blush and I have like this kind of um, fresh look. A fresh look, a nice natural Ma glow. Good. So... I think and now, Caroline, okay, you can touch, and now, Car Caroline, sorry, you can touch your, your lashes. You will feel that they are still very soft and not dry and stiff. Very, very subtle and soft. Super soft. Super I'm soft. The lightest and, and so greatest mascara for me because it really does feel just soft and, and easy and it's so easy to apply exactly so many waterproof mascara are so dry and stiff at the end this one is totally the opposite yeah. and super long lasting final touch <laughs> the final touch we're going to use one of my favorite product and 
we just, just received a prize in Asia, the first prize uh, for the best, you know, lip product in Asia with uh, the Lip Comfort Oil. So I did send you two because I have two favorite ones for you. Yes, you did receive the mint and the red. Yes. And I would like you first, I did select the mint for you because of course you live in Miami. So for the people who are living in, you know, Middle East or uh, hot humid climates or hot climates or anyway, as long as you want to plump up your lips, mm -hmm. I want, as long as you like, you know, a touch of freshness, go for the mint. The right. mint, you know, <clears throat> is enriched with three different, you know, lip oils. So you have the hazelnut oil, the organic jojoba oil, plus you have, you know, white mint in this one. So that's the reason why when you apply it on your lips, you feel a little bit, you know, that freshness. Mm -hmm. And that fresh effect does plump up your lips to smooth your skin, your lips. So because all those oils are nourishing and give you extre ext extreme comfort to the lips, okay? and plump up the lips. So and that's the reason why. So you can see that it doesn't look, you know, green, okay, on your lips. It does enhance in a very natural way, your natural lip color. And I think that's so important to say because it can look scary, you know, with the, the bluish. It's strange, you said, oh. But yeah, yes. it, looks, it looks great and it feels so amazing on the lips. And my lips, you know, get very dry. So for me, it's so yes. important that they don't crack and they just, it's so of easy. course, because, okay, you're a tennis player, you are working out, you know, uh, quite every day. You live, you know, uh, somewhere in Miami, okay, with a lot of sun, so it dries out the lips. And now, do not forget Caroline, because most of us, unfortunately, but it will stop very soon, I hope, okay, we're all wearing a mask at the exactly. moment. And the mask does really dehydrate, uh, dehydrate the lips. And, and, and really irritate the lips. Mm -hmm. So please, you can go use the Clarins Lip Oil, Lip Comfort Oil, because it's really going to nourish, to give mm -hmm. you the comfort that you are losing because of uh, your mask. And it's never going to stain your mask anyway. So use it, use it, even if you're wearing a mask, use it under your mask, very oh. important. I so you know that you know, the lip oils, they can be used you know, alone, or it can be used on the top of your lipstick. So mm -hmm. you can use the lip oil on the top of your regular lipstick, a satin lipstick, or even a matte lipstick. It's really nice. And if you want to go a little bit more glam, for a little bit more glam, mm -hmm. okay, you can add on the top the red. I'll do that because this is my favorite smell. I love how it really smells. So I'm gonna add to my Yes, so this one, the red color, okay, also contains so hazelnut oil, organic jojoba oil, plus the anato oil. Each color contains a very specific plant oil, okay, according to the color. What for? To provide maximum comfort, to nourish the lips, to really protect the lips, and plump up the lips. So, what do you think, Caroline? Tell us. I absolutely love it. And, um, you know, I feel like I'm wearing nothing, you know, on my skin. It feels soft. It feels great. It feels, you know, it just brings out the best of me, which I love. I, you know, with being such an athlete and always being out there, I, I want to look like myself, but I, it's nice that you can just add a little bit and, and look fresh and look good and it stays and I don't have to worry about it. And, you know, it's so, important for me that it takes five minutes to do. It really is. Exactly, you can see it's quick, it's easy, it's simple. You don't need to, to, to apply so many you know, products, not at all. Now, if you're looking for something a little bit more glam, more makeup, really, you can start from you know, this level and after, okay, you can add a little bit of highlighter here. You can mm -hmm. add a little bit more blusher. You can add a second or third color of eyeshadow. You can add a little bit of eyeliner. You can add the darker shade on the lower lashes. Uh, you can add a lipstick before applying your uh, lip comfort oil. Mm -hmm. Everything is possible. But what I wanted to show you today 
it's a makeup style according to your concern and your needs, okay? According to many women's concern all over the world, because there's few people who takes, you know, half an hour or an hour to apply the makeup in the morning. But most of the women all over the world, they have, you know, at least, you know, five minutes. So Absolutely. you have to go straight uh, with the right products who are going to enhance your natural beauty mm -hmm. and take care of your skin, okay? So I'm so happy, Caroline, because, you know, Clarence, we always want to take care of the people. We yeah. want to take care of the nature and we're using the best of nature in our makeup products because makeup, Clarence makeup is made for skin. So uh, it was so beautiful to share uh, those secrets with you and with all the followers, all of you guys. Thank you so much for following along today. And thank you for helping me look this radiant and shiny. I feel great now. I'm thank you. You did a wonderful job. Thank you know what, Caroline? You are number one in makeup too. Thank you. <laughs> so, and now guys, okay, I don't know if there's any question. Uh, there's a lot of people who are in love with the makeup. So this is really nice, really good. Thank you so much, guys. And we are, it's okay now. So, Caroline, let's go to the beach now. All right. Bye. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you. Take care. Take care of yourself. Take care of your skin. We love you. Love you, Caroline. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye.